Hey little big heroes, I know, I know, where are all the create mode videos? Where are your own dreams projects? But wait, I can explain, and I'll also tell you about one of the big projects that we have planned for when early access arrives, if we get in that is. If you enjoyed today's video, why not give us a like? If you're new to the channel, subscribe to become a little big hero, and don't forget to click that notification bell so you're always kept updated on the latest dreams content. When I got into the beta, it was like entering a place filled with sheer excitement. I wanted to explore, check out every menu, test out all of the creation tools, play every level from the community, there was just so much to do, I couldn't contain myself. Sadly, I had to travel for a few weeks shortly after I entered the beta and was unable to do much during that time. Luckily for me, Media Molecule extended the beta by an extra two weeks, but I used that time to catch up with all of the creations I had missed whilst away, and I still wanted to test out the crate mode to answer some questions which I needed answered. I couldn't make anything like a game or a short animation in the time that remained, but I don't regret that as I love testing out the game and all of your own levels. But looking over the content we have made so far on the channel, uh, okay, I kind of regret not having some crate mode videos for you as of yet, but I have a solution. I may not be able to show you any in-game progress or concept art, but what I can do is tell you about the progress I've made in terms of the script and some of the gameplay from this early planning stage. This project this project is actually one that started many years ago. I was talking with a friend online making fun of various video games and I thought, wouldn't it be hilarious if there was a game which just mocked everything and players could just enjoy a fun game with laughs all the way through. This was back on the PS3, Xbox 360 days when everything was so serious with shooters and war games, so I wanted to bring a bit of humour back into gaming. Today there's probably a lot more humour in games now, but I'm still excited to bring this idea to life. Originally, I didn't want to make this game on Little Big Planet. Instead, I wanted it to be a Unity game, which I could then make as an indie developer. Sadly, I never got around to mastering the programming side of things, but ever since Dreams was announced, I've been patiently waiting for the day that I could finally start making this project. What's this project called, I hear you ask? Well, if you didn't read the full video title, the name of the game project is Fallen. Weird name, right? It almost sounds a bit like Fallout. <laughs> You're so funny, I see what you did there, y you changed the name into an opposite version, <laughs> classic humour. Well, yeah, that's pretty much how it started, a stupid joke for a stupid game that wouldn't be ashamed of being just fun. So is this game anything like Fallout? Well, not exactly. Fallout was the base, the foundation for the game, and then I would add in various other video game parodies as you progressed. Since it's been a long time since I originally wrote one of the funniest gaming scripts of all time, I've changed some of the finer details, but a lot of it remains the same game. I made a post on a couple of Dreams forums about a year ago explaining some of the details for the game. This is everything I wrote. Very first gameplay project from Little Big Animation has finally been announced. And I say finally because it's actually been in development for quite a number of years. Coming from Little Big Planet, you'd think that this was an ongoing project, but nope, this stretches far further. You see, I've always wanted to create video games, and I guess this project was more of an experiment to see if I could plan and design an entire game. A ridiculous game. Now that Dreams is nearing completion, <laughs> oh, if only I knew, if only I knew. I believe the project can take a more complete form. Originally this was a game which parodied a huge number of video games, but has since evolved to parody much more. Fallen is an open world joke fest, which involves a vault dweller, let's call him Jim, who on his 21st birthday discovers that his father, let's call him Jim Senior, has went missing. Jim builds up his courage and ventures into the wasteland to find his father. Before Jim can explore, he accidentally steps in a super radiation puddle which causes a mutation in his foot, a mutation so severe that it develops a personality of its own. Jim and Mutant Foot must travel far and wide across the vast wasteland in search of answers as well as aiding and hindering others on their perilous yet hilarious journey. Fallen will be an action RPG with a third or first person perspective. Main quests will be given to drive you forward, however many inhabitants, weirdos, of the wasteland have quests of their own which you can assist with. Conversations will be vital in order to bypass combat or discover secrets. 
mutant foot can also speak the language of many other mutant-like beings. Ammo will be limited, therefore firearms should be used scarcely, relying on melee weapons until you've found or bought enough ammo. Jim is not an experienced combatant, I blame too much gaming, so he will improve his skills as the game progresses, as will Mutant Foot with a range of special support abilities. Documentation and other rarities will be scattered throughout for players to discover with bonuses and rewards for those who do, and not to mention trophies, all of which are platinum, just because we can. So yeah, I pretty much still stand by that description of the game. As soon as I, hopefully, get into Dream's Early Access, I will be making a lot of small projects to practice using all of the various tools and improving every day. Yeah. I'll be creating every day, as I'm sure a lot of you will be doing too. Once I'm happy with my own personal development, I will start immediately on this project and I can finally show you all some in-game screens and trailers. I may need some help with the larger projects, so of course if you want to offer your assistance or form a partnership to help each other, then I'm all for it. Ideally, I'd like to work on this game for a year, perhaps a year and a half, but let's see. It could take longer or even less if I have a team of creators helping, but you can always expect something new from us every week as we learn how to sculpt, animate and all of those things. That's all for now, but I'll try to make a habit of doing one of these update videos every week, talking about both small and large projects within Dreams, and maybe even some from Little Big Planet. What are your thoughts on Fallen? Sounds pretty awesome, right? And what big projects are you preparing for Dreams? Let us know down in the comments below, and we'll see you in the next Dreams video.